The discovery of penicillin by Alexander Fleming in 1928 and the subsequent development of antibiotics has revolutionised the treatment of infectious diseases. However, as their use has increased, bacteria have adapted and found ways to defend themselves. Bacteria are living organisms which evolve and are capable of adapting to defend themselves against antibiotics, thus rendering them ineffective. Some bacteria can defend themselves against several antibiotics, making them multi-resistant. There are three main methods of resistance. Mutation. An antibiotic has to fix itself to a target in order to react. If the target changes through mutation, it can prevent the antibiotic attaching itself. Example, tuberculosis is becoming resistant to streptomycin. Modification. Many multi-resistant strains produce an enzyme which can break down the antibiotic and render it ineffective. Example, resistance to penicillin. Repellents. The bacterium closes the pores through which the antibiotic enters the cell. Some bacteria are capable of expelling the antibiotic by pumping it out of the system, effectively spitting out the harmful element, as is the case with many hospital-generated opportunistic infections. So, ideally, the way to halt the progress of resistant bacteria is to curb the excessive use of antibiotics. <laughs>